Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Crusader Kings 2. We are playing as a Bengal Empire. I have created the uh, Kingdom of Jia, and I've given out the stuff. I did end up deciding that uh, it was best to just create the uh, uh, the duchies and give them out. He should hand them out, because he's over his duchy limit anyway. Uh, I have lost a lot of people. <laughs> um, let's come back to... Oh, let's see. Chancellor... I don't really care as much about Chancellor, so yeah, you can go ahead and be a Chancellor. That will please you. Uh, you are a commander, but you don't have a siege trait, so I'll go ahead and make you Marshal. And um, this Tangut guy, why not? Kind of likes me. I need money, though, right now, so let's go ahead and collect taxes. Let's go ahead and train troops. Okay, I did lose four commanders. You can be a commander. You can be a commander. You can be a commander. And... You can be a commander. So, please start educating those uh, people with good traits. Uh, let me give a day to pass. A couple days to pass. I do have all these troops. Dangerous factions. I'm... I feel like this should not be applying anymore. Because I have way more troops than they do now. Because I'm down to 35 out of 51. In fact, I'm going to raise up those troops there. Okay, that's got 41. Let's raise up everyone, start moving them up that way. Yeah, they're going around, which is what I want. All right. Let's uh let's see if we can uh win. Daughter was born. Title loss on succession. Shadam of Andra. Okay. County is converted. Yep, no more uh, dangerous factions. I can ransom some people. I'll go ahead and do so. Anyone that I can uh, banish? Couple people that I can banish. Won't get any money for it. Okay, go ahead and um, get you heritage, and I am going to release you from prison. You are 44. I do not mind banishing you. I do not need you. All right, so Shadam of Andra. I wish you could mark some of these and... Okay, it's agnatic, cognatic. Whereas the rest are agnatic. Alright, I'll have to look at that one. But as long as I don't die right away, uh, it'll be fine. So they're marching up. You've inherited a mosque, that's fine. Uh, right, I don't want to be looting, actually. Uh, you go do some looting for now. So that I can get some more money. But I am making money at this point. Alright, 16,000. Uh, I can practice some reading. Okay. 
All of that is done. Let's take you. You over there. You up there. You up there. And you go straight through up there. Alright. Seljuk lost that uh, land of Durbent. I should probably quickly move on to uh, gobbling up Seljuk at this point. Because otherwise my vassal is gonna my vassals are gonna do it. Alright, you're coming in there. We can assault that. We can assault that. Hand artwork added to his treasury. Okay, given that that is a, a bit of a more... Well, I should be able to do it. Disallowed vassal wars, that's fine. Okay, took that. Go ahead and assault that. Move in. We are winning, so we'll get a uh, major victory. They have not s stopped to siege down, which is perfectly fine. Castle is finished in Dalinga. I'll go ahead and give this to you. What is it? Arg of Hedong. There you go. <clears throat> All yours. Okay, he was captured in battle. Let's actually go to over there now. Okay, 100%. There we go. Offer peace, enforce demands. That's what I needed to do. All right. Uh, ask for help. That's fine. Technological advance. Uh, let's go for tolerance. Anything else that I can do? Can't get more military organization yet. All right. Well, in that case... We're done with that war. Let's go ahead and disband all of our uh, our troops. Okay, so um, yeah, I mean, we did kind of kind of do some heavy, nasty damage up here. I think I will keep this one because I do think that I would like to get this to have the walls, just because I could always give it out later. He's not a very good person to hold the territory anyway. And there are a bunch of cities there, so I'll get some extra tax income. Alright, are you any good? Uh, you're a nine. You're a nine. You can have that territory. Okay. Um, sure. Uh, I will probably give this guy a Juquan. Um, he won't move his capital, but eh, whatever. You can have a human. Actually, yeah, human's pretty good. I think she is better, but human's pretty good. There we go. You're still in a revolt. You can have uh, Yang Wen. Well, you know what? I think I will give someone a Juquan anyway, and if he uh, usurps it, 
he usurps it. There we go. Okay, so let's see. Chica. Actually, you know what? It is part of his... Oh, I cannot get that. Because he's at war. Uh, I'll wait until I can usurp that for now. Well, no, I'd better not. Stop backing that plot, please. Auto stop all these plots. Okay. Let's wait until that happens. When the first Sokka armies clashed against the Chinese regiments, few anticipated this outcome. While the Middle Kingdom put in a valiant effort, I mean, did it? It has ended in a sullen retreat, as it is finally clear that the Han Empire has lost the war against the Bengal Empire. Shahan Shah Indrapal stands victorious, while the agents across the world. Well, agents across the world are wondering what repercussions this will have for the political map we have come to know. The Han Empire will remember our name. Okay, so what I will want to do is when I... I think I will not get rid of these guys yet. Um, I think I'll do that when I have done the last war against Western Protectorate. Uh, and that's mainly just because... Let me go ahead and pull you off for now. They're pretty good at assaulting. Because you really just need troop count to do that. So because of that, I think I will go back to uh, letting them reinforce... Go ahead and do so. I'll probably lose some money for a bit, but... They're ending their plots. Ending your plots. Why are they still moving? Are they now in the other war? They might be in the other war now. Oh, no, they're not actually in... They're, cause they, they, they're just events spawned for him. He's in another war right now, so he they didn't disappear. Ah! <laughs> That's actually kind of funny. Um, I wonder if me... Uh, doing anything... Well, he's at negative 56 monies, negative 56 prestige, and 76 uh, karma. I I may have, uh, you know, really, really done a number on, on him that way. Well, alright, so, um, could turn around and go after the Abbasids. Start focusing on that. Uh, I just need these three left. Or we could always go after uh, Utsang. That might be what we want to do. Let's go ahead and uncheck that. Let's go do some looting first. I would like to get some more money. And you know what? I'm going to send you back home so that I can add some more troops to you. Uh, yeah, let's not do it that way. 
Let's go around and down this way. We do not need you up here anymore. Okay, we'll just wait for these uh, people to end all their plots. We are pleased that you have completed the construction of a new temple. 300 devotion, excellent. Let's go ahead and get rid of that. Transfer vassalage to you. There we go. All right. So he has given out these duchies. He has not given out these duchies because uh, he doesn't have them. Which I should probably do that so that he'll give them out. So it cost me a bit of money, but. No, not transfer vassalage. Grant land a title. There we go. And I guess I can give you this one too. I mean, I could always wait. Give this out to him later. Like, there's a lot of titles that I could make that would uh, get me more opinion with some of these people, but I don't care right now at the moment. It's fine as it is. I've become charitable. Praise be Shiva. Okay, he has acted dishonorably towards me. He is the leader of a plot. He has... Sent gift, taught a virtue, personal diplomacy. End your plot, please. Hmm. Even at 100, he won't do it. There's something up with that. I don't know what's going on. Sind has declared Sind Holy War for Merv. Uh, can I ask you to be peaceful? No, I can't. Alright, Sind Holy War for Merv. Uh, I would like to get involved in that, so... Declare War. Holy War for Merv. Dang, Delhi has a lot of troops. Let's just go ahead and get up there. County of Rothaus is converted to the Hindu faith. Oh yeah, didn't you, uh... Didn't my guy convert a county and I forgot... Forgot to move him. Yep. Okay, go up there. All right, we got two Sokka counties up there. One of these over here has converted. I'm not sure which one. Uh, more Sokka over here. I think it's this one here. Oh, good. Oh, good. Oh, because I'm always worried about that. You know, just like these are never going to convert now. Well, not never, but very, very unlikely. They should just be generating um, Bedouin people at this point. And I kind of want to figure out... Like, I'm... 
I could destroy this one at some point if he uh, rebels and fix that. We got a uh, 15. There's a chance, although your the religion has already changed, so that's not terribly likely to uh, change. We've made uh, made the map pretty bright red, though. Uh, raiders under a host. Up there. Hmm. Alright, 3,000 troops. We can go ahead and use them. So who is actually occupying this? Kutal. I have not noticed that Kutal is involved in a war here. <laughs> there are three wars. Oh, that's great. Because his liege is declared a war, and his liege de and and then his liege's liege me declared a war too. Ah, oh, it's pretty great. It's pretty great. Yeah, I'm not going to do anything about either of them. Although I could take this away. Uh, retract Vassalage. Does this guy only have that one? He does. Only have that. And he's Pichang. What? What? Yuck. Sign Guardian. Diligent and gregarious. Okay. Uh, human. Fifty one gold. Raiders of a Arrived in Ray again. It's really annoying. Okay, Heritage Focus, please. And another daughter was born. Uh, this is to my brother. He will be taught well. Nope, stop it. Let's go ahead and take care of you. Comdo, 81 gold, looted, very nice. Uh, raiders have arrived down there. 68 gold. Seriously, how many troops do you have? You got 10,000. You need to do more, sir. Also, have a kid who's good, please, so I can put you on the council. I mean, I could start uh, giving the kings artifacts, like the books that I, I don't have, like give books to one guy that I want to always be my um, my steward kind of thing. Might start considering that. Where are you going now? Forty-nine gold, ninety-three gold. Ah, it's so good. So much money to be had up here. Okay, siege to that. 
Destroy the trade post in Merv. Wait, what? Oh, Kundax host. Okay. Well, Merv isn't the greatest county to hold for myself anyway. Oh, I could go to uh, war against Zhang Zhong for that county. I should consider that. 25 gold. Look, I am going to chase you down. I really wish that I had a movement speed guy. He moved his capital. That's not the wise... Well, okay, he personally holds it, so I think he will keep it. But if he dies again, he wouldn't. Uh, I will fulfill my duties as expected. You died, you inherited. Any, uh... Nope, that's just my really old bloodline. Skull trophy. Okay, subject is converted. Uh, set aside worldly worries and focus on matters of divine nature. Pick the theology focus. No. I mean, if you were asking me to seclude myself, yeah, I, I'd consider that, but no, no. no. All right, we have looted all of that. Let's go over there. We've looted all of... Uh, we have not looted all of that. Go up to Arjun. Oh, my vassal did get uh, this stuff. That's the Nepali guy. I did not get you educated. You are Sokka. I guess that's okay. For now. And you personally own both of those. Okay. Well, not my preferred... thing, but... Uh, not a whole lot that I can do about that. Need a new commander. Sure. Cut through there and do something. Who is uh, who's fighting here? Alamut. All right, that's just an internal war. That's fine. Good, catching them. Uh, let's see. How are my stats? Uh, my diplomacy is up pretty high. Let's go for Marshall. And I can invest in technology. Uh, construction imp or improved keeps. Construction. Let's go with that. That will get us uh, more build time, build cost modifiers, great build, co uh, great works build cost and build time modifiers, and a, a new hospital complex. Which I can't afford, but... Um, oh my god, 42. I think that's the highest level. Let's check. Please tell me that's the highest level. It is. Good. All right. Oh, thank God. Uh, I, that said, I am going to want to eventually get uh, these hospitals up that high. I'm losing money right now. Construction of stage one has finished of the Muscat Harbor. Uh, let's rename it. What shall we call it? Uh, Great Omani K. I 
think that's... I've seen... I've, I've heard it pronounced K... Like, well... Given that I have primarily seen it written, and of course, wouldn't always understand it uh, to be spoken if I heard it pronounced K, but uh, I usually hear it Quay. I usually read it Quay. But I think it's supposed to be pronounced K. But it's kind of silly. Just, just call it Quay. Alright, so we can get Piers, local tax modifier plus 2%, uh, supply limit, trade value, uh, and then Harbor Office, tax modifier of 10%. Trade value plus 30 might be worth more, I'm not sure. Uh, the Kothon, not really worth it at, the, at this time. Lighthouse, tax modifier plus 5, and trade value plus 30. Um, I am going to want the Master of the Tides as well. Uh, road tolls would be good. Tavern could be fun. I mean, it is a harbor. Um, That's going to be a lot of money, though. I think the lighthouse is best. It gives you the trade value, also gives you some tax modifier, but we're definitely going to want the harbor office, the piers. The harbor office and the piers. So, yeah, we'll start with the lighthouse. Was there, are any of these cheaper than the others? Uh, actually, the road tolls are cheapest. So I'm going to go with that first, because it's cheapest. I don't mind uh, spending the money only on that. Okay, 16,000 coming my way. Can I get out of here? Nope, because I have, did not notice them. Oh well. Probably going to get uh, attacked there. But it's fine. I mean, he does have a lot of troops. Still has a bunch of event spawned. I don't know if any of those are in there, but it's not a big deal. Uh, Tibet's going to... Tibet's really getting trounced. And uh, I don't know if Utsang has enough land to form Tibet afterwards, but uh, Utsang is essentially becoming Tibet. Anyway, for now, we'll go ahead and call it an episode. When we come back next time, we are going to be uh, usurping a vassal war, which I'm always happy with doing <laughs> when they're doing wars that I don't want them to do. And uh, then we're going to turn our eyes onto Utsang, maybe Zhang Zhong, uh, maybe the Abbasids. There's a lot of, uh, lot of potential possibilities. There are also um, holding wars that I definitely need to do. Like this one and stuff like that. But that will all be next time. See you then, everyone.